everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today is Fear the Walking Dead Season 4, Episode 5, Laura. Finally we're going to get some answers about the mysterious Laura slash Naomi. And my favourite fish, uh, John Dory, is going to be the main focus of this one, as well as Jenna Elfman's character Laura. And Jenna Elfman is a great actress and Garrett is lovely. Go follow him on Twitter because he's really awesome. So let's go with Episode 4, 5. John Dory. Okay, this is giving me Eastman vibes already. Now it looks like the beginning of Westworld. Oh, no way. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Brilliant. Someone needs to employ a cleaner. Why is he putting a word with a regenerator in the coffee? I would go insane. He's watching telly. Where is he getting this electricity from? Oh my god, I would go insane. Uh oh. Walkers don't usually look that clean. Laura, that's how they met. Oh. Okay, that's not a bite. Good news is not a bite. That's about as good news as you can expect these days. Oh, oh, ow. I'm sorry. She's yeah. a nurse, you can pick the cell phone. I'll take care of this one as best I can and I'll get you to sleep, okay? Oh. Oh my god, she has a thing with stealing cars. The key. On top of the bag. Yeah. That's a weird sound for a car. It needs new battery. Ha, it doesn't even work. Ah, you got shit out of luck, Laura. If you're gonna go, then I might as well set you up with food and water. Make sure you rested. We might ought to change that bandage too. Oh, oh dear. That's a fucking fish hook. <sighs> she can start up herself, can't she? <gasps> no! No! Can you do it? Seriously? I don't know. I can't. Stitches. Oh, I'm not mentally prepared to see that really. Oh. You see people get eaten, but you can't see someone get sewn up. Are you sure about this? Just How do does it. that work? Fish stew. Huh. <laughs> He's so proud of it. I believe hmm. the French call it bouillon bags. <laughs> He's so cool. They probably use that as a scrabble word. You're making me feel soup. awkward. Soup. soup is the blanket of food. <laughs> what? <laughs> Aww. 
I'm not a fan of your sleep then. You look like a Laura. If I had to guess. Oh. Would Laura be an acceptable substitute for now? You look like a Laura. Yeah. I used to work at Humbug Gulch on weekends. <laughs> you might know it more as Wild West shows. Oh my god, that's Some why he's got the hat get up. Oh, that, that's just funny, I like that. You know, you are welcome to stay here as long as you need, Laura. <laughs> I'll be moving on as soon as I can. <laughs> Look at them in their matching flannel. Yeah. How'd you know I was a nurse? again. This is such a mirror of Eastman and Morgan. I love it. That episode is the best. Oh, you should probably rest up. No, I need some new dressings. I don't want this to get infected. I can get those for you. I'd rather do it myself. Yeah, let the woman have well, some independence, hon. They already look like a couple in the matching flannel and their cute hats. They're already on their way. Look. Good while, I suppose. Like the bridge that Daryl and Mel were on in season three. Now, oh. no lift today. There's your problem. Yes, ma'am. Something that needs tending to. The store. What is this place? Uh, it was Bill's. I think it was his father's. But he was been in the family for 60 years. <laughs> How long is it going to take everything to run out? Do you reckon that's where he got his hat from? That's her bag! Oh my god! Oh! You rearranging the place. No, she's preparing to People escape. People always need splints and dressings. When you're in trouble, it's hard to think outside the box. Oh, bless her little heart, she's putting little care packages together for people. Oh my god, that's cute. You can have a job that's still useful now. My name is John Dory. Like the fish. <laughs> I like fishing. Yeah. We're gonna need a ladder. Oh, they're gonna border up the highway. Oh, no, she wants to watch a movie with ya. Tuesday's usually my movie night. Oh, well, you know it's Tuesday, yeah. though. Every night's pretty much movie night these days. You know, sometimes at movie night, I take my butterscotch and my caramels, melt them together into a kind of brittle. That's a good show. I can take some blackjacks from Bill's earlier. Maybe we throw a couple of loves in there. Aww. Oh, this is so cute. Now she's either going to leave. Why is she staring at him, actually? Oh, no! What? 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 You did? They both got hats. They've both got flannel, waders. Look at them two. They're going to be the best couple ever in five seconds. Hey, hey, hey! Tip up, tip up. I better be a walker and ruin it. Oh, this is so cute. I love this. Thanks for teaching me. Now, couple's dining. This is going to be brilliant. I love this. 
is she going to finally wear the, the boots? Once she wears the boots, you know she's going to stay, right? Uh-oh. She going to leave now? She's bitter. Please don't leave. No, no, no. I was going to be leaving. Soon as you were able. Take a couple days, pack some things. No, you won't. What can their ship name be? I know her name's Naomi. Decide on that. Look, you're team killing. This is just, they're meant to be together now. Shit, room of shoes. Now I'm going to have to wear your boots. Now. Or he'll get injured and she'll have to look after him. Whoa, calm down! Woo! Overkill? Look, now she's gonna have to change her clothes! It wasn't close enough to back you. See, people get really sick from just being exposed to this stuff. Shit! Well, just like the actual walking dead. You could have stopped it. Oh my god! You had the gun. Not how I do things. When you do things, nearly got you killed. But Glenn well, managed to put it over himself, so did Rick. Better me than somebody Still else. Still confusing. Doesn't matter how many people say it's not your fault. They're gonna bend, bond. They're gonna bond over shared trauma. What's the bet? And she had a part to play in her daughter's death. Well, by accident, maybe. They're gonna bond over shared trauma. Oh, mosh. Why do relationships like this have to be destroyed in The Walking Dead? Come on! I want a happy ending. There may be trouble in my head. Shit, her. Why do good things have to go with the mess? Look, Billy! What are you doing? The guns will be shot now. Yeah! died because of him? Yet to use the guns? I ah! I wasn't expecting that! I mean it now. Because you're going to leave. Ah! I don't want you to. Ah! I don't want you to. Ah! Don't want you to. Ah! Don't want you to. If you want to be on your own, you stay. I'll go. They need to do that if Instagram alive, thing. World, it goes do do ding. Oh! So world feels alive. Oh, I love them. Yes. Do, 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 do. Please don't have left. No! 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 Oh, she got scared and left. No, no. Oh, she left the shoes and took the boots. You got 
want to step out the door. Please don't have left. He said they got separated, not that... No! <laughs> no! I know what happens, obviously, because of the Walking Dead, Fear the Walking Dead now. No! alive now after all this right they would have done this please don't have done this and she'll be actually dead what I believed yeah where's your positive mindset go tell me that's what you believe tell me that's what you believe and we'll we'll go our separate ways I do not believe that oh I'm in pain let's not waste another second Positive. I don't believe she's dead. She can't be. Love that gun twirl. No. Oh man. Ah, I love this episode. The story didn't progress too much at all, really. We just got a backstory episode. But it means so much because it gave us the more emotional pull towards them too. And it made us care more about him and Laura. And they've got to find her now. They can't give us this food just to take it away and just to not give us anything at the end. We've got to find Laura. I'm positive that this means we're going to find Laura alive. Or Naomi alive at the end. Please. Maybe she's somewhere in the unknown with Madison. Maybe they escape together. I, I don't know. This episode was great. With the boots and, and, and the scrabble tiles and oh, the candy. We finally found out where that came from. Uh, we got uh, John's backstory with the guns and how he's a police officer, which sort of mirrors Rick a little bit, even though Rick doesn't have any problem with killing now. Um, I like that, that was so good. So emotional and so much love there and he said they got separated but she left him and oh, oh, she got scared and left and we found out that she had a daughter or a child anyway and they bonded over shared trauma. I don't have a bad word to say about this season at all and considering if you watch my reactions for season three you know it was all bad words well not all bad words but if you watch my reaction for season three of fear the walking dead you know how much i didn't really like it there was good bits and bad bits but this has been solid absolutely solid storytelling and i'm going to say it these four episodes were much better than the first four episodes of the walking dead season eight so far it doesn't take away the fact that I really enjoyed season 8 and there will be a review coming, I'm just editing it right now. But this is eclipsing everything that those four episodes of The Walking Dead weren't. This is what I want to be transferred over to The Walking Dead, so I really hope they do that next season. I hope Angela can pull it off. Scott Gimple has a big hand in Fear the Walking Dead and it's a shame that this is written so well and it has what The Walking Dead lacked last season. So, I really hope that they do that in Season 9, because this is absolutely bloody brilliant. And hats off to everyone who works on that show, and Garrett uh, for do, for playing John so well, and Jenna for making us love Laura, and we don't really know much about her, but we do now, and absolutely brilliant. So hats off to everyone that works on Fear the Walking Dead, and it was it was brilliant. Let me know what you liked and disliked about this episode and the season so far, let me know in those comments. I will be answering comments this week. Thank you so much for all the support. Uh, I'm now reacting to Scam, which is a Norwegian TV drama like Skins in the UK. So if you want to see me react to that, definitely head over to my playlist, which I will leave up there and on 
uh, down in the, in the description. Thank you so much for all your support. We're nearly at 4,000 subscribers, so thank you to everybody who subscribed over the last month. We've jumped like a thousand, which is absolutely pff, just blows my mind. So thank you so much. We've got 163 days until The Walking Dead comes back. Uh, I only know that because um, I'm going to Atlanta for Walker Stalker Con this year, and it's the day after I fly on the day after The Walking Dead comes back. So, if you want to meet me in, in Atlanta, if you go into Walker Stalker Atlanta, then let me know down below. I need all the powers I can get because I'm going alone. It's my first solo holiday. So, if, if you have any tips, uh, let me know also down below. Um, all the people who went to Walker Stalker Nashville yesterday, I hope you had an amazing time. All the pictures were amazing. So, uh, share your stories down below if you went to Nashville. Uh, thank you so much. Everything you need is in the description. My PO box, uh, Twitter, Facebook, Instagram are all down below. Uh, don't forget to check the notification bell to be notified every time I post a video. And I'll see you in the week for a review of this episode because I loved it. And I will deliver this time. Work has been crazy, so I'm sorry. Uh, I want to turn this channel into more substance. There's only reactions on this channel, there's no theories, there's no me, there's no substance in this channel and I want to bring that back because when I first started reacting to Fear the Walking Dead, uh, when I first started my channel, there was so many theories about The Walking Dead Season 7, there were so many theories about Fear the Walking Dead and there was more than just reactions and I've lost that so I need to bring it back to the channel so I will be bringing it back. So just keep an eye out. Uh, I do have a PO Box sort of haul thing coming up. Um, thank you to all the wonderful people that send me stuff to my P.O. box. I love you guys with all my heart. Uh, if you want to send me anything, letters, anything you fancy, uh, my P.O. box will be on the screen and down below. Uh, so much love to all you guys. I hope you have a wonderful week. We've gotten over the dreaded Monday. Uh, I hope you have a wonderful week and I'll speak to you soon. Thanks for watching and I'll see you later. Bye everyone.